President Muhammadu Buhari regretted that the well thought out policy of the Farah government, which was conceived after wide consultations with stakeholders across the nation, had been largely misconceived by some section of the general public. Also speaking to newsmen after the meeting, leading delegation Archbishop of Just, Reverend Ignatius Kaigama, said Nigeria appears to be under siege as many negative forces seem to be keeping a stronghold on the population, especially the weaker and the defenseless. The concerns of poverty, our young people unemployed and the idle away and resort to hard drugs and very violent behavior. Um, you know, they, they hurt men and the farmers. It's so disgraceful that we should kill ourselves in Nigeria because these two groups are each other's throats. Uh, we feel there should be a solution, a, a very civilized and enlightened solution. Kagama recommended a quick resolution to the current problem in order to ensure peace, stability and progress of the country. He can combine the two interests in herding and farming and come up with a solution that will be fair and uh, all the different groups will feel they belong and they have been adequately assisted to do what is right, to avoid killing and destruction of lives and property. Our president can do it. He needs the support of his team, those who work with him, to give him sound and genuine advice so that they can forge ahead. They can do it. The bishop assured that the church will continue to make its contribution to nation building through prayers, admonitions, and assistance to the needy. From State House Abuja, I am Hassan Umar Farouk for Liberty News.